So today I want to paint a dog rose for you and I'm going to be doing this with the Pebio Colorex inks. Now they've got this natural range which are beautiful soft colours um, and I'm going to be using the natural red, the natural orange, green, yellow and I may use the violet but it's quite a strong one so I'm going to keep to the natural colours um, and then at the end um, well, let me save it to the end and show you what I'm going to do. So I'm going to set everything around so that you can see what I'm doing and we'll get working. Okay, so I'm going to start putting some colour down. I'm starting with the natural orange. And then I've put some of that down I'm just using water now, just to pull that out. And then I'm going to come into this um, natural red. Taking some of this colour back out, I don't want too strong. So again, just using water just to really soften this colour down. I'm just using the rear end of the brush just to drag that around. These natural colours are just so pretty. So I'm using this natural orange and then that natural red together. Dragging one through the other onto the water. Ooh, that went nicely. So just dropping in that natural red. So again, just coming back in now with water. So 
just pulling that round. So I've got a couple of dots of the red that I've put in there, just scribble around, that gives you some nice texture into the centre. secondary, this bud. So just, again, that last little bit of dragging. I'm going to put in a little bit of stem. Scratching through. So I need that to dry now, and then I'm going to come back in and do something else. But I'm going to pull you in just to see how that's drying, because I love the way this paint is working. It's Okay, so what I want to do is add some of this to my rose, and this is a mirror foil. So it's a two-stage process. You need to put down um, a fixative for it, a glue for it, um, and this is the, the glue I'm going to use, Mixtion Relief, um, and it goes on white and dries clear and takes about an hour to dry. So I'm just going to show you putting a little bit of this on. So you literally, you just draw with this tip and you just draw on with it and then you have to allow that to dry. So rather than making you wait, I've already done that. And so I've got my piece of foil. You can see it's been well used, but there's still plenty on there. And I'm going to put this gold in the middle. If you have a look, you can see that gold just glinting. It just sticks beautifully onto that. So I'm putting that around. So you can see there. There, so that's my gold. 
And then I'm going to use the silver, and my silver is running out, but I'm going to use it. So I've got my silver here. And I need to get some more. So you can see I've got the gold and then the silver back there. You can see I'm just putting this so you can see this drawing with the with the silver foil so I've drawn with it I'm trying not to do it as an outline yummy this stuff So I've put this foil on top and I've got the gold in the centre of my flower and then the silver on the petals and I think that's rather gorgeous. Mm. Love it. I hope you enjoyed that. Um, and I have to say, I do really like these natural colours from the Pebio uh, Colorex range.